nation this day and age to read any good news on the newspaper page and love and tradition of the grand design some people say it's even harder to find well then there must be some magic clue inside these gentle walls cause all I see is the tower of dreams real love bursting out of every scene everybody it's army princess and welcome back to the channel today we're going to talk about something different not army videos but hair so i do have people who are here for the hair videos and as you all know i am on a healthy hair journey so i decided to jump on the bandwagon but change it up a little bit so let's talk about quinoa Quinoa is a grain. I thought it was for food. This is what I usually eat it in my food. But apparently it's very similar to rice and it's good for your hair. So these are the Yao women and they use rice and rice water in their hair. Everybody found out about it and decided to jump on the rice water challenge. People are doing rice water all over the YouTube community to grow their hair long and strong like the Yao women. So I decided to use quinoa instead of rice because quinoa has way more benefits than rice. Okay, so for this challenge, instead of using rice, like I said, I'm going to use fermented quinoa and quinoa water. So this is day one. I have just washed and cleansed my hair. I don't really have anything in it at this point. I just detangled, and this is how much came out of the comb as far as the shedding. Shedding has been horrible since postpartum pregnancy. But um, this is my quinoa water. It's been fermenting, like I said, for about three days in this mason jar, and I'm going to apply it to a um, applicator bottle and put it in my hair but before we get into the results of the quinoa I want to talk to you a little bit about quinoa and all the benefits that it has in your hair so quinoa offers vegetable protein to gently cleanse and nourish your hair its amino acids help repair damage to the hair shaft while its proteins coat strengthen and protect the hair packed with vitamins and minerals as well as amino acids Quinoa can aid in hair growth while preventing breakage. Many new shampoos and conditioners are utilizing this beneficial herb. Look for hydrolyzed quinoa protein. This type of formulation is believed to form a protective barrier over the hair shaft while it encourages sheen. Its humectants attract moisture from the air while generally conditioning your hair, yielding a well-defined curl pattern and a sexy head of hair. Okay, so on day one, I wanted to put this quinoa challenge to the test, and I decided to section off two parts of my hair. One, I section off on the side, and then the other part is in the beginning, and I'm going to actually measure on my shirt where my hair ends on day one, or where it stops, I should say, on day one, and then I will come back on day five and see if we got any growth. So now that I have my landmarks, I just go in all through my scalp with the rice water. I start with my edges because that's my problem area. That's where I had the most postpartum shedding. But I'm just going to go in every day with the rice water. I think this is day two and I'm back at it again. Just going in with the rice water all through my scalp. So by day five, I was over it, y'all, over it. I actually did do the rice water every single day for five days. I just didn't record every day. But by day five, I was over it. I was seeing results, though. I was seeing results, 
but it's just a lot of work to do it every single day and it's like as you can see it's dripping all over my shirt it was messy it was stinky it was everywhere my hair my scalp right here is so dirty but i'm looking at the new growth here by day five my new growth was super duper thick like thicker than normal and i actually had to get a relaxer sooner than i would have gotten it but i could definitely see the results by day five okay so we have finally reached wash day and i think i washed my day my hair on day seven so on day six i didn't do anything with the rice water i did put it on my edges but i didn't actually do it but by day seven i washed my hair and this is all the shedding that I got I was like amazed I was in awe this is a better picture of it see the big one and then the small one literally a week difference and that's how much shedding came out this is the very next day um, because I don't blow dry my hair I let it air dry I couldn't really do the the test to see how long it got that day but this is the next day I'm taking down my braid and I really didn't think I would see too much of a result because my hair was like crinkly and it had been braided up. So here I'm just trying to detangle it and straighten it out. Just one little strand came out so that I can measure and see if I got any growth. And as you can see, I got some inches y'all. Not inches, but probably about a, almost a full inch. I was, I was just shocked really I really didn't think that I would see any growth so I'm gonna do a side-by-side -side so we can compare it so this is day one when I'm actually marking the area and then this is day seven when I actually or eight when I actually do the measuring and you can as you can see I gain I gain y'all Okay, so now we are about to compare the front section. In the front, I didn't really gain that much, I gained, but I did gain probably about a quarter of an inch. So it was at my lip, and now it's about a quarter of an inch below my lip. So that is the difference. I, I'm, I'm shook. I'm still shook. I didn't really see that much of a difference in my edges, but my edges was like on struggle mode times 1000. So I am going to continue to use it on my edges because I saw such a big difference in the overall like length of my hair. And I will say at the end, my hair was very, very healthy and strong feeling. I love the way the quinoa made my hair look and feel. So it works. So here I'm just showing you how thick my hair got. Look at my roots. It was like hard for me to even part it. My hair was so thick. I had so much new growth. Um, and I actually got a relaxer sooner than I would have. So this is my relaxer results. I got this relaxer at the beginning of June. And I gained since January. This is me with the, with the little wispy hair. And this is just a still picture of my edges up close. So my edges is coming along, y'all. And this is the next day, my gym workout. I just was admiring my hair. Okay, y'all, so overall, these are the results of my relaxer. It's been probably about three weeks now since the last clip. That last clip was the very first day that I did my relaxer. Um, I am really loving the results of the relaxer. I think my relaxer took like extra, extra good this time. I don't know. I don't know if it was the quinoa water, but I am definitely a fan of the quinoa water. As y'all can see, my hair grew. I really was not expecting it to grow because in the past, I've done all of these challenges like the massage challenge and the vertical challenge and the I don't know I did some kind of like coconut oil massage your scalp for a seven days challenge I have never ever seen results that fast as I've seen in the quinoa water challenge I really really um, was like flabbergasted by the results so I'm definitely going to continue to use the quinoa water especially on my edges because I think that it's helping grow my edges back it's only been about three times that I've washed my hair now since the last clip that you washed and I have minimal shedding now that I I have been using. Definitely, if you are on the fence about trying out um, rice water or quinoa water due to shedding, due to hair loss, if you just need your hair to grow, child, sis, sis, 
try it out it works like I am now a believer that it works I just would not suggest to use it all the time because it is protein some people have protein sensitivity some people get protein overload but I would say every four weeks you know it's not it would I don't think it would be an issue but it worked for me so I'm just telling you what worked for me and I did not think it would work for me and it did but this is it y'all i'm gonna end it here i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in the next one bye hey if you want to see more videos like this then make sure you hit that subscribe button like what are you waiting on